Hey, what's up guys, Ndafara here. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can make a WhatsApp call or video call from your PC or laptop. The first thing that you have to know is that you can use WhatsApp desktop or WhatsApp web to make a call. This is because both those applications don't have the functionality to do so as of now, but it can change in the future. So to make a WhatsApp call from your laptop, you need an Android emulator. An Android emulator basically mimics an Android device. So it'd be like you've got a new Android phone on your laptop. On this emulator, we'll then install WhatsApp and then make the call. There are a lot of Android emulators out there, such as Bluestacks, Nox Player, and End Emulator. In this video, we'll be using the Nox Player. So just go to the Nox Player website, which is www.bignox.com. Once it opens up, click on download. This will start the download, which is 368 megabytes in size. I have already downloaded it. So I'm just going to go where I saved it and then just double click it to launch the installation. Depending on your Windows settings, user account control will pop up asking you if you'd like this app to make changes to your device. Just click on yes and it will launch the Nox Player setup. Let me just close these windows. Click and read the license agreement and then click on install to start the installation. So to read the license agreement, it's pre-checked. Just click here and then you can read it through. Once you're done, just click it and then just click install to start the installation. This will start the installation and give you a warning that in case of problems, deactivate your antivirus. When the installation is done, it will show the start button. It will also install two shortcuts on your desktop. If you have used Nox Player before and you have backed up data, you can click here on import backed up data to import it. If you're like me with no backed up data, you can just click on start to start the emulator. It will take a bit of a time, but once it's done, it will ask you to log into the Play Store. As you can see, it wants us to log into the Play Store, so just click on Login Now. When this comes up, just put in your email address and then click Next. And then just enter your password and then click on Next. Agree to the terms by scrolling down and clicking on I agree. This is for demonstration only, so I'm not going to enable backup. So just deselect this and then scroll down and then click on accept. With this, we are ready to install WhatsApp. So if you have it on your homepage, like I do here, you can just double click it and start the installation. Otherwise, go to the Nox App Center and then search for WhatsApp. As you can see, I already see it here. So if you just select it and then open with Play Store always and then click on install. Accept all the permissions and then it will start the installation. After the installation is done, just click on open to launch WhatsApp. Read the privacy policy as well as the terms of service and then click on agree and continue. WhatsApp requires you to verify your phone number. So just select the country you're in here and then put in your number. After that, just click on next. It will ask you for a confirmation for the number and then just click on okay. Here, just enter your verification code. It then asks you if you have previously backed up to Google Drive and if you want to restore that backup. I don't have a backup, so I'm just gonna click on skip. It then asks you for a profile name. So I'm just gonna call this code demo and then click on next. Because I used a demo number, I don't have any contacts here, but if you have contacts, you are good to go and you can call them. So to fully demonstrate, I'm just going to create a contact and then call that contact. So to quickly create a contact, just click on the chat icon here and then click on new contact. As I said before, this is just for demonstration only. So I'm not going to create a backup. So I'm going to click on keep local and then I'll just create my contact. I'm going to call it NKT studios. And then I'm going to put in the number. Once I'm done, I'm just going to click on back to save. As you can see, my contact was saved. Now, all I need to do is just click back and then select my contact. I can now make a video call or a normal call. I'm just going to select a normal call and you will hear it in the background.
So until WhatsApp desktop and WhatsApp web have the functionality to make normal calls or video calls, this is how you can make a WhatsApp call or video call on your PC or laptop. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like this video and subscribe. I'll catch you in the next one.